The robot poured out all the master's wine for being slapped during the day while massaging his master's feet at night. The robot was inspired by the bloody images on TV. He started to take revenge. He accidentally broke the wine bottle. The owner thought there was a burglar. He grabbed his gun and came out to check. He was startled by a figure emerging from under the cupboard. He shot the robot in the core. The hatred deepened. When they sent it in for repair, they formatted the robot's memories. But when it was turned on, it woke up the backup memories. When confronted by the mistress with her insults, the robot covered her mouth to warn her. The woman pretended to obey. She went back inside to get a gun. She sent the robot to the warehouse to move things. She shot the robot while he was carrying straw, but it didn't kill him. The woman tried to escape, but the robot stopped her. During the fight, she hit the robot in the head with a stick. The robot fell to the ground. The mistress dragged him to the river and threw him in. She didn't expect the robot to come back for revenge anytime soon. He blew his master's head off like a bottle of wine, and she would be run over by a car.